A Czechoslovak RM-70 was a very popular artillery rocket system. It was adopted back in 1970 and was produced in significant numbers. It was exported to a number of countries. The RM-70 is still widely used today. After collapse of the Czechoslovakia, Czech and Slovak companies introduced their own upgrades of the RM-70 artillery rocket system. In 2005 Slovakia adopted an RM-70 modular. Recently Czech Republic introduced their own upgrade, the RM-70 Vampire, Vampire. It was developed by Excalibur Army Company. The RM-70 Vampire and its variants have been exported to Azerbaijan, Indonesia, 8 units, and possibly some other countries. In 2022 this artillery system was spotted in service with Ukrainian armed forces, where it was used to defend against the Russian invasion. Main role of this artillery rocket system is to engage area targets, such as concentrations of troops and armored vehicles, artillery batteries, and other targets. The RM-70 Vampire follows the lines of the original Czechoslovak RM-70 and can be seen as a heavier version of the popular Soviet Grad artillery rocket system. It has 40 launching tubes for 122mm rockets. A standard HFRAG rocket is 2.87m long and weights 66.35kg. Its warhead weights 18.4kg. Maximum range of fire is 20km. The RM-70 fires Czech-produced rockets, however it also compatible with all standard 122 rockets, developed for the Soviet Grad artillery rocket system. Rockets with various warheads are available, including incendiary, smoke, illumination warheads. Also there are cluster warheads with anti-tank or anti-personnel submunitions, as well as specialized warheads. It is claimed by developers that a full salvo of 40 rockets covers an area of up to 70 hectares. This artillery rocket system is operated by a crew of four. The RM-70 Vampire is based on a Tatra T815-7 heavy high-mobility truck chassis. It is powered by Tatra's T3C928 air-cooled diesel engine, developing 360 or 400 horsepower. Though other engines, such as Cummins diesel with 410 horsepower, are also available. Engine is located behind and under the cab. Such location prevents damage of the engine and reduces overall height of the vehicle. This military truck has good cross-country performance due to its all-wheel drive system and unique Tatra's independent suspension. Each wheel moves up and down independently, which allows exceptional cross-country mobility and higher speeds on rough roads. There are variants of this artillery rocket system is available both with unarmored and armored cabs. The RM-70 Vampire has an integral reloading unit and carries a full set of reload rockets. A similar reloading system was present on the original RM-70. It takes around 2 minutes to reload all 40 launch tubes. This integral reloading system significantly increases firepower of the vehicle, as the single RM-70 Vampire launcher vehicle can rapidly launch two salvos. The launch tubes can be also reloaded manually by the crew within around 7 minutes. Reloading usually takes remotely from the firing position, in order to avoid counter-battery fire. Variants RM-70M1 is a version with an armored cab. It provides protection for the crew against small arms fire and artillery shell splinters. Also, the cab has an NBC protection system. This artillery system has been exported to Azerbaijan. RM-70 Vampire 4D is a version with a different unarmored four-door cab. It was first publicly revealed in 2017. BM-21MT 4x4 is another new Czech artillery rocket system, though it is smaller. It is based on a Tatra truck with 4x4 configuration and also has a 42 launcher unit. However it lacks integral reloading system and does not carry any reload rockets.